Hey, Kelly, yeah, Bill.com, it's not one we talk about every day, but it is one of the big performers during the pandemic. The software company automates and digitizes back office operations, take invoices, bills, and other payments, for example. Two things are making it a Wall Street favorite this year. First, digital payments. During the pandemic, businesses and consumers as well are moving away from paper-based payments and what analysts call inefficient processes. Second is SaaS. Not the type of SaaS you might be thinking of. It stands for Software as a Service. Investors tend to love that predictable subscription revenue. Its core customers are small businesses who are getting hit disproportionately hard by COVID-related shutdowns. But Wall Street is looking past those near-term challenges and betting on some of the bigger trends at play here. New opportunities include some more partnerships that already has some white label deals with Bank of America and JP Morgan, as well as Intuit, and grabbing some more of the 30 million U.S. small businesses as the economy goes digital. The company just went public in December. It did see about a 30 percent dip this year as that lockup period expired in March. But it's up 80 percent since then and about 160 percent this year. Some of the biggest investors got in when the company was still a private Silicon Valley unicorn. Timasek, August Capital and a well-known software investor, Emergence Capital, are among its top shareholders. Kelly and Tyler, back to you. All right, Kate, thanks very much. Kate Rooney reporting.